I'm your produce guy, and today our produce tips are about avocados. Got some great uh, tips about how to prepare, and we'll show you some of the magic right now. Okay, now remember, you want to find a, a nice dark Haas avocado that yields to gentle pressure. That's when it's ripe. When you go to open these, now, by the way, these tips I learned not in the produce department, but this is from my restaurant experience. That's where I learned this. Learned how to pick out avocados at the store, but uh, learned how to prepare them in the restaurant business. So take your avocado, remove the little uh, stem that usually is attached right there. Then to open it, you get a sharp knife, slide the knife down till it hits the pit, spin your avocado around, just like that, and it opens. Oh, nice little pit there. All right, now, this can be uh, trouble to get out if you don't do it the right way. Uh, I used to, before I learned this, I used to try and dig it out with a spoon, and that's not the right way to do it. Uh, the simple way, now make sure that it, you have to do this correctly. Make sure that your fingers are below the surface of the, the sides of the avocado here. Then you take your sharp knife and you just tap right into your seed. Twist and out. That's how that's done. All right. Now, let's take... Uh, we need to remove this from the, from the skin. And you get yourself just a, a regular serving spoon. And you run that spoon... You run that spoon inside the shell of the avocado, and there you are. A perfect half of an avocado there. Now, at the uh, restaurant, we used to use avocado all the time on sandwiches, and we would just slice them up just like this. And then you've got those slices that can just be laid out on a sandwich, just like that. Now, a lot of people ask the question, is avocado a fruit or a vegetable? Well, I've got the answer for you, and we'll tell you a little later on in the segment here. But we're going to take this next avocado, and we're going to dice this up rather than slice it. So we, we do the same. Go on the top with the knife all the way around. Twist it, exposing the pit, pulling that out, just like that. To get the pit off of the knife, you just take the handle of the knife and you whack it against, well, I'd like to do it against the garbage can and the pit goes right in the garbage or any, any firm, solid surface. You can hit it there and the pit will come right off. Anyway, to dice these, the simplest way, rather than pulling them out of the shell right now, we dice them right inside the shell. Kind of like we did with our mangoes and our black bean salsa recipe. You, you dice them before you remove the skin. So, just rolling right through there. So we've got a nice dice on that going both ways. Let's get our bowl over here. Once it's diced, then you bring out your spoon. And look at that. All diced up and ready to use in a recipe a recipe like our delicious guacamole recipe we've got coming up. So, in answer to the question, is an avocado a fruit or a vegetable? Well, it grows on a tree and it's got a pit. And so it is a fruit, not a vegetable. Same debate about tomatoes. I have a different answer for that one. We'll talk about that another time. But really simple. Get that avocado done, and that is ready to go. Okay, well today we've shown you how to slice and dice, remove the pit of an avocado. Also, if you missed a tip in the When Is It Ripe segment about how to ripen an avocado, uh, when you purchase a, a green one at the store, pop it in a, uh, uh, a paper bag. Paper sack is what you want. Set it out at room temperature on the counter. Check it every day, because it'll ripen quickly inside that bag. We've, uh, we've diced our avocado, and in a minute we're going to make some delicious guacamole. So, uh, watch for that video upcoming. Sure appreciate you tuning in today. If you haven't subscribed yet, please hit the button up above and join us. Uh, also, you can follow us on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash 
your produce guy. And of course, I love your comments and suggestions. Thanks so much for visiting with us today. I am your produce guy, and remember, fresh is best.